More information about the investigation concerning the disappearance of a Colorado woman this past Thanksgiving. That information is being released. It's just been over a month since Kelsey Burrith was first reported missing. Her fiance has been charged with her murder, but her body has yet to be found. Steve Patterson has more. This morning, a multi-state investigation into the Thanksgiving disappearance of Kelsey Barrett, the Colorado mother who disappeared in November. Police in Twin Falls, Idaho, releasing a statement saying in part that they had worked with the Colorado Bureau of Investigations and the FBI to prepare and serve several search warrants, as well as processing some items of evidence. The news comes nearly a month after Barris' cell phone pinged a tower in Gooding, Idaho. Barris' fiance, Patrick Frazee, arrested on Friday, police carting him away from his Colorado ranch. Patrick Frazee was charged this morning with first-degree murder and solicitation for first-degree murder. The solicitation charge opens up the possibility that others may be involved in her death. At this time, there is only one arrest. Um, I don't know if there's going to be additional arrests in our future. The desperate search to find Kelsey, now officially a search to find her body. Sadly, we do not believe Kelsey is still alive. The arrest comes after investigators zeroed in on Barris' home, making multiple trips, hauling away evidence. Investigators have recovered a number of items that make us suspicious that the crime did occur at Kelsey's residence. Barrett was last seen publicly on Thanksgiving Day, spotted on surveillance video shopping with her one-year-old daughter, who police say is now in protective custody. Frazee told police he saw Kelsey later that day at her home. She then vanished, with cinnamon rolls still on the stove, her car parked in the driveway. Police scoured Frazee's 35-acre property he shares with his mother for any sign of Barrett, but came up empty. This morning, the mystery of Kelsey's disappearance deepens, while the man prosecutors say is responsible for her death sits behind bars. A phrase he is being held without bond. His next appearance scheduled for New Year's Eve.